I'm gagged. I'm gagged. No words. No way. I knew it. <gasps> Damn. <laughs> Welcome back, gay schools, and everyone in between to our YouTube channel, The Horror Bandwagon. <laughs> Hi, my name is Sergio. And my name is Cody. And we are boys for horror analysis. Criticism. And spooky. Okay. And sometimes kooky. Entertainment. And welcome back to the last reaction of Yellow Jacket season two. This is the official finale for this season. Are you ready? No, not at all. I mean, hey, we are now officially part of the the, the soccer team. They, they hired us, they put us in. I am mostly doing, uh, I'm giving out water. I'm making sure towels are all like restocked mm -hmm. uh, because I really think I'd be bad at soccer. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just cheering along on the sidelines. Woo. Oh, so you're the cheerleader. I contribute to the bake sale. That's my main role. Oh, that's true. He's a really good baker. But anyways, guys, we are ready to dive in. There's so many theories. There's so many questions. I am a little worried if they're able to kind of stick the landing with solving everything, but not everything needs to be solved. There needs to be some things left for us to really like munch on until season three yes and one slight correction to my theories from last week that just as i've been mulling it over as we usually do listen yes. these are always instant reactions of ours so it just sucks that it does it takes us days until we're like okay now i get it go join our discord if you don't believe me i have receipts <laughs> but i Still don't think that Walter is going to help Misty out of the good of his heart, but I'm starting to think that he is actually secretly part of the cult. Maybe uh, he manages their money or something, and that's why he has that big house. Okay. And not because he just won some lawsuit a couple years ago and now has a ton of money. We'll wait and see. I could still be wrong. I'm not putting a Jameson shot on it, but that's where I'm at. I had a random ass dream that Walter killed Jeff. I don't know how. I don't know how that would happen, but it came to me in a vision. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll have to see. All right, and we are not going to make you wait any longer. So before we get started, make sure that you like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and click that notification bell so you get notified every time we post a new video. And if you want to support the channel even more, you can go over to our Patreon at patreon.com slash the heart bandwagon, where we have full length watch alongs of all the Yellow Jackets episodes. And finally, make sure that you join our Discord so you can chat with us about Yellow Jackets and anything else that's on your mind. The link is going to be in the description below. But without further ado, let's get into it. Ooh, this is exactly how I feel like after last episode. Oh my gosh, I can't even imagine. Yeah, like what do you? Oh, my heart already. You, you're not gonna tell him. He, she can't bear it. She can't tell him. How do you tell him? Oh, and look at Van. Van is literally like, yeah, and what? <gasps> oh, that's so disturbing. I can't believe that they have a body. I also do think that Thaisa's other half is like taking over right now too. And that could be true, but I'm interested in that theory because she always had such a physical change when that happened. When I give it what it's asking for, we have to do it the way we used to. <gasps> we should give it a hunt. Uh oh. Oh my God, Shada. I don't even know if that's worse or not. <laughs> Still in us? Yes. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Not Shauna siding with Lottie. <laughs> of, of course you're not. Unless she's trying to plan a way to of escape. Course. That's what this is. I think that's what's happening because like, look at the faces she's making. She's like, well, what else am I supposed to do? She's trying to like communicate with her facial expressions, yeah. We all know what she went through out there because we all went through it too. Yeah, except we got over it. She thinks it's time. Mm, that's debatable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, okay, what a, what a start to an episode. Uh -huh. Misty, why was Travis screaming? 
it's so crazy that Lottie literally was like, take my body. Mm -hmm. And they're like, nah. We're going to eat Harvey. What? <laughs> we didn't even kill him. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> During the cheese, uh, Harvey, Harvey died, so Misty. it's okay. I do like that Lottie is having a little, like, trouble knowing this. I didn't want this. How could you let that? How could I? You started this. Never turn your eye on Misty. <laughs> she will call you out. All of our lives. So you better not start making people feel bad about it now. I think it's really interesting the acting choice of like having her like almost be like smiling as she's talking about this hunt. I think it's just this actress being really good. She really knows yeah. her character as Misty. Lottie's pleased with the wilderness's choice. She says Harvey will save us. Once again, she is pushing this plot along. You're gonna use that little knife to. Well, listen, Shauna has learned some things in this wilderness. Oh God, can we just give it a minute? Like, can, can you let him grieve? <laughs> I mean, this definitely helps explain why Travis was so affected by what happened out here. No, for sure. Okay, that was respectful. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. I mean, this is the first time really, as we said before, like the first time they're intently doing this. Okay, I thought you... Yeah. I mean, I get you don't want to see, but I mean, I guess what's the worst? What, what are you going to do, you know? Are we going to see this? Oh, no. It is showtime. They're like, they're like, here, show full decapitation. I don't think that's what they're doing, Baba. What are they doing? They're finding his aorta to drain his blood. Oh! You guys should leave. Wow, she's really good at that. <laughs> Let me find your Ayota really quickly. Ayota. <laughs> also, I should correct myself. That's not the aorta. That's the jugular vein is, I think, what they were actually draining. But we are not medical professionals. Mm -mm. We've been through this already. With that. It was not this effective. <laughs> <laughs> That shotgun is going to come into play at some point. Who are you? Announce yourself. Is that Walter? Misty? <gasps> Misty? <laughs> what are you doing here? Well, I came to help you. He's, he came to help! I'm still, I'm still on the fence, though. So am I. My trust has been broken many, many times. <laughs> we pretend. We all swear we would. Are you going to tell me that they made an alliance as children so that they all stayed alive? <gasps> like some sort of like all stars thing? Oh, no, that would be so much stuff because then they deliberately chose who was going to make it out. I mean, we would need fake passports. A bunch, probably. Are they going up to the cult? Yes, they are. Oh, no. All roads lead to the compound. Wait, look. All right, this is it. I don't know. I feel like you should have called first. Yeah, I mean, not that it would have... Well, let me take that back because he has already called the compound, so... <laughs> you need, like, a burner phone. Don't open that. Hmm? Wow. Yeah, they certainly look culty. Um, let's uh, find another way in. Oh, this is screaming that Jeff is going to die. Who is this? Who is this? Who is this? <gasps> ah! No! 
Did they know or were they just following them? They this were whole following time? them this whole time. Oh fuck. This place seems fun. Maybe it's gonna be him. I think it And then everyone will rejoice. <laughs> you trying to teach me forgiveness. It's a nice idea. I honestly feel a little bad for Natalie this season, adult Natalie, yeah. I, because I feel like it's just been a, a like a r road to recovery that seems like it just leads back to like more problems, you know? Well, and this has happened before with her, right? She's been through rehab a ton of times, but this time she was actually taking it seriously. This is bad. No, I think you should still be underground, sir. Ooh, I'm gonna have to blur this out. Yeah, walk away. Walk away. Where have you been? Natalie. Nowhere. Don't worry about it. I, I think that you and I together could probably survive the winter. Hey, do you hear me? No. No. How can you say that? I let him die in my place. It was supposed to be me. I mean. Ooh. The acting of that one single tear. Yeah. You should be ashamed. Well, I'm not. I'm glad I'm alive. Just like you are. And I don't think that any of us who are still here should feel- Teen Van is going full in. Mm -hmm. After everything he went through out here, don't you owe him at least that? Do you think Van is actually the villain of the season? You know, she was talking to Thaisa about, like, it could just be us. It kind of feels like she's playing games. I mean, she might be, but I still think it's clearly Missy who's the villain of the season because she's the one who I talked to Lottie. she'll always be a villain. She talked to Lottie and came down and was like, let's, let's do that hump thing. It's not really that unusual. What, what See, I, I'm a detective, too. Not like you. Alas, I'm a lifelong asthmatic. This is so weird that they're like meeting right mm -hmm. now. Why it is that you are here? Hot Poison. Cocoa? Poison. Sure. He only poured in one of the cups. You're being awfully judgy about mom, considering this all started thanks to your lame attempt at blackmail. Hey, maybe. Yes, Kelly. Look after your mom. Go find your mother. What? What are you gonna do? I'm going to take care of this. What does that mean? This splitting up is not good. Yeah, no, it didn't work in Scooby Doo. It's not working here. My methods aren't exactly admissible. Oh, he's We're just going. fully walking into the conversation. Yep. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, man, because you're looking a little. I want you. I mean, I he is butting in, but granted, if we were on the flip side, he's probably doing his job to solve this murder, so. It was a crime of passion. I, I found out that Shauna was sleeping with him, and I went to confront him, and, and I wound up killing the guy. I mean, that, that, that's a fair story. It is a fair story. To protect her. I did it to protect our family. Oh! <gasps> I knew it! Oh, shit. Kevin? Oh, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> <He's like, laughs> Jeff was about to give the performance of a lifetime. Fuck! Oh, Hiya. Me <laughs> Creepy as Walter. Cult? People? Oh, no. Do you want to help me move this body? What? Oh, no! <laughs> if Javi was able to survive this long, maybe Coach Ben will too. Weird. Yeah. It's Javi. It's Javi. This whole time we were trying to find Javi. Is she just gonna like th throw him like catch? Oh my god. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, that is so weird. I'm sorry, guys. That's so weird. Oh.
I was not expecting him to take a bite out of it. Me neither. I thought it was. I thought it was just something sentimental. I thought it wanted what was best for us. No, I'm not so sure. I mean, remember, Misty has to really lean into this entire thing because it is entirely her fault why they're still there. Yeah. Potentially. Your team needs you. Eat. It is the the part where like Lottie has created monsters. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, it's tender. Sorry. It just like really ripped apart really well. Oh no, yeah. no, 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 no. Uh, well, we've calmed her down, <gasps> and we're gonna bring her to Whitlock General ourselves. Okay. You know what I'm starting to think that might be a twist here. That Van was in on it the whole time. Maybe. I, I mean, because she... like, why would she like go? I don't know. There's a lot of time missing between between Van being how she is right now. Yeah. Well, uh, in the past to now, I'm just getting super nervous right now. <sighs> Lottie, are you good? It's time, yes. Oh no, Callie. Oh no. Hello? Is she gonna accidentally kill Callie. the cop? How's it going? Oh no. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Get away from me. Yeah, seriously, you're creepy. Kevin, what? Kevin. This is what Walter's doing. Hey. Kevin, no, he did it. Yo, Walter's Ghostface. Walter's the next, <laughs> right? next Ghostface. I may take back what I said at the beginning of the video. I think that he is a lot less concerned with doing right and more about just the fact that he solved it. So now everything else doesn't he's matter. Part of the detect it's the thrill of the, the whole thing. Yeah. But he's panicking. So that's a start. He's going to request backup. Like, this is not going to end well. Yes, I've made certain of it. I'd like to shuffle those some more. Of course. Do you think Nat is going to draw the card again? That'd be fitting, but I don't know. I really don't know. You can trust us, you know. Right, Van? Shauna, that's probably enough. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. She's giving into it because of the cancer. Or she was always on Lottie's side. I'll start. Oh my God. Oh my God. This ain't good, this ain't good. No! Taisa, are you refusing the draw? Guys, this is ridiculous, come on. But I mean, all of them have a reason to be here, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, last time it was all out of desperation. Now they each have their own agendas. Yeah. <laughs> I hate this. Fuck. Maybe oh, do they just keep drawing until yes. until one of them gets it? That's so fucked up. Oh. Guys, I can't keep going like this. This score is so effective. Yeah. <gasps> what are you gonna do, Shana? Shauna out of everybody can cut everybody up. <laughs> hey. Come on. Oh, this is so fucking crazy. Oh. It's up to you. The way we used to, you can. Oh, yes, Miss Owl Lady. I mean, I'm loving the mask, so. Okay. Yeah. So you've all actually lost your minds. John's underestimating her plan here. Uh-huh. Are you running? Is that your choice? Oh, fuck off. Girl, run. It's time to run. Yeah. Oh, I'm so nervous. Callie's going to get caught up in this. I know. Oh, holy shit. 
new recruit nearly lost his life uncovering his partner's involvement in a sordid police corruption scandal. Sorry, come again? I'm gagged. I'm gagged. No words. When the police dig in, they'll discover a wealth of bank and phone evidence connecting you and Missy are perfect for each other. To the I do love them together. But also to the recent death of a known political operative, Jessica Roberts. <gasps> there are all those bank and phone records pointed to you. I'm sorry, but oh. creepy guy, you met your match. You might want to close that. <gasps> Damn! Oh, fuck! fuck. I mean, I'm sorry. He was such a fucking douche this whole time, mm -hmm. and Walter served it to him. Served it. <gasps> oh, Get shit! Oh, Callie! Mom. Callie? Stop it. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I know. Me too. Where the fuck is the psych team? They're not coming. It was Van's idea. <laughs> <laughs> just calling her out. Just hold her out. While you were sleeping again? The Princess Bride. What about something you haven't heard before? Van has went completely 180. Huh? He chose me, I think, because, because I was the only one who knew how to listen. But I can't hear it anymore. It's, I feel like it's passed on to a new person. And that isn't me. How do you know? You're wrong. We need you. The wilderness chose who fed us. I do love that, like, as a culture, we all are calling her the Anther Queen. Mm -hmm. They're just calling her the wilderness. I I think it's Shauna who's ultimately going to get it. Especially then, you were always its favorite. Why can't you ever stop? Don't move! <gasps> oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, Lucy! I knew she was going to show up. Yep, you're on your own, Coach Ben. You're on your own. I thought he was gonna set fire to the cabin. Oh my god. Oh shit, they're all doing it. Yep. And we did see that vision earlier in the season with Natalie with the horns yep. and everything. Welcome to soon. Yeah, everyone is fully in. Mm-hmm. But what does that mean? Like, what is she gonna do? I don't even know. Oh, tell me! Have you just been lying this whole time? No, no, I... Answer me! Lisa, please. <sighs> I let him die in my place. No, She's no. She's gonna jump in, in the way. Oh, She's so misty. <gasps> no! No, no, no. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, what is happening? And that's probably like the, the fentanyl, right? Mm -hmm. What do we do? Nothing. <gasps> it's too late. No way. They truly killed Nat? Yeah. <gasps> you know? <gasps> oh. This is exactly where we belong. We've been here for you. Oh. Oh, God. oh, female deceased of an apparent drug overdose. Oh, this is so sad. I know. I'm just like, I just can't believe she's she's the one who died. Walter, I killed my best friend. <laughs> oh, I do love them two together, even though it's so dysfunctional, but yeah. Sorry, dude, you messed with the wrong people. They're gonna keep you for a little while, but we're gonna come check on you. I guess just to like reevaluate things, you know? It is pleased with us. You'll see. Why is that like at her? Maybe her cancer will go away. That's what I'm thinking. She wanted to be the head person. Yeah. Guys, wake up! 
He's setting fire to the cabin. He set fire to the cabin. Oh shit. I don't, know it. don't tell me the show's gonna end on this. Damn, they're not they're not to be messed with. They know what the fuck they're doing. Man, yeah, better get the fuck out of there. Mm -hmm. Wow. Their only place of comfort is gone. Mm -hmm. Yo, Coach Ben literally was it's just like. Well, no, I like, I don't think he's doing it like out of malice. I think he's, he's really like viewing what just happened as bad. Yeah. No, but, okay, you can't say that it's Adam Madalus. He tried to kill them. Yeah, but my point is he's not going around being like, yes, he's like... Well, no, but, like, realistically, he's just like, this needs to be stopped. Yeah, absolutely. Maybe that'll cause somebody to, like, help? Maybe. Ugh. Oh, Damn. I hate that. I want to know so much more. All right, guys. So that was our reaction to episode nine of Yellow Jackets from season two. That is the finale. We are not getting another episode. We don't know when we're going to get another episode, but we are left with so much. Like this now ricochets into like a whole big other plot point. What There's just so much to cover as to what happens left. There's still a lot of pe people who like, we don't really know the fates of. We can only assume that, you know, Mari, Akila, like they're all probably not gonna survive. Um, and whatever that means, they still really haven't found Crystal. Um, yeah. So like that's, the, they, they definitely could have used that as a body instead of mm -hmm. killing Javi first. Um, but I think overall, this finale, I think this finale went out on a bigger bang than last year, than, yes. than season one. But there was just so much going on in this one that I was like going from one place to another and I was like, what the fuck is happening? Oh my God, like I just didn't know how it was gonna end. I think that the way that they buttoned up the Adam Martin thing, uh, I mean, it, it certainly worked. <laughs> I didn't see it coming at all. I was very surprised to see Walter like actually step in to try to save Misty. Yeah, like he made sure all tracks were covered uh -huh. he was looking out for his girl i totally respect that again in the context of this show in real life it would probably be a different story yeah but i i totally felt like walter was going to really come through for for them i love that his character truly wants to protect them whatever that will mean for misty and walter we don't know but it kind of seems like she found her match that is able to be just as crazy as her mm -hmm. um, and go to Lex, do whatever it took. And I like that. I, I honestly do. I like that character and I hope Elijah Wood does come back for season three. Me too. I'm also just still devastated from Nat dying. I mean, it, I, I do think Our that it's a, it's a fitting end for her character, stepping in to actually no, save somebody that she cared about. I mean, but it, it's what she, she wanted was, to do. She wanted to, she, she wanted to really protect Lucy and we also don't know where Lucy went. I think I her think... name is Lisa. We've oh, been doing fuck. this for like this entire season. Fuck. We're so sorry. I'm so sorry, <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> I'm gonna have to edit that in into the edit. Um, okay, Lisa, I don't know where Lisa went, but she definitely knows a lot. So mm -hmm. they're gonna have to really make sure that she stays quiet. This cult is in shambles. I don't think it's, it's not gonna run anymore. Um, but yeah, she did sacrifice for Lisa and to make sure that she was okay. I felt so bad for Missy because she was the cause of it, um, which it's so funny because the showrunners did mention that at the beginning, the first pilot episode, Natalie sees a vision of Misty, but Misty wasn't actually there at the, it was at the party at like the, mm -hmm. the party before they leave. Um, and that never comes back again, like, but until today, like today, the vision came back and we saw like the reason why, like Misty ends up killing her by accident 
Um, um, but I really like, for me, I thought we were good with the core group. I didn't think that the show was going to kill them off, especially a favorite. For me, Natalie is a favorite character of mine. Like I love Juliette Lewis. I love her and everything that she's been in. And I can't believe they pulled that. They really did it. But the whole season, I kind of felt like it was leading up to something. Because even I mentioned in the episode before, I was like, it sucks for Natalie because it seems like everything that she was doing in this season led to a different row. Like yeah. she was trying to find some sort of purpose. And maybe this was it. And the thing that got me was when she was in the airplane and she kind of felt like she didn't want to die. Yeah. Without saying the words, she didn't want to die. She just said, I don't belong here. And that was emotional for me. I don't know what it was. It was kind of like symbolic and seeing her actress, her teen actress, be with her, share the screen for like, you know, I, I think they've done it before, but like not like to each other, which yeah. was kind of very like emotional. Yeah, I agree. I, I, I am happy that Nat finally got to save somebody. Um, but it's just, it's so sad to see her gone. And Natalie is such a tragic character too. Like the way that she's grown up, what she ends up doing after she they get saved and all that stuff. I'm only imagining that, you know, they're probably gonna bring back Juliette Lewis in flashbacks and stuff like that. Um, but they're obviously gonna keep young Natalie because there's a lot to cover mm -hmm. in, in that aspect of the show. I feel like we have so much. I wanna say that there's a second winter because they probably go into like spring, and then go into another winter yeah, before they get saved. Because I think they were, they said they were out there for like a year and a half. Yeah. So they crashed in fall, and yeah, they would have another winter to go through. Now they don't have the cabin anymore. I do think that they're going to move underground, and and that may be, you know. Well, they're definitely going to try to find Coach Ben because they're going to want to fuck him up. Because and, I think the only other person that could have done this is Coach Ben. And Ben told Nat that he found where Javi was hiding. But he didn't tell tell them where he didn't tell her where but i think that's going to be their next move is mm -hmm. they're going to kill coach ben and then take over his place which is going to be sad but overall i think the season was great i loved it i love this journey we went from not knowing what's going on we met lottie we met adult man uh i drank a jameson shot because mm -hmm. you know and then look at look at where we are now like i was shit because javi it's no longer so but you called ben burning down the cabin before it happened that's true i should have bet on that anyways let us know what you thought of this season let us know what you thought of this episode were you heartbroken as we were let us know make sure you also go over to our discord we're gonna be talking about yellow jackets a lot over there um and we're gonna miss it so thank you so much for joining us until next time we have been your source for horror analysis criticism and spooky and sometimes kooky entertainment bye everyone bye